The best part about being in the mountains and running through it is just how freeing it is. Natural oxygen, the air, I mean, there's nothing better than being outside in nature is really incredible. My name is Ellen and I'm an avid runner and volleyball player and all around active person. It's so really important for me just to get a good sweat every day. It just makes me feel better. It makes me happier, more energetic. So I really like to get after doing some type of hit volleyball running. I make sure I get a daily sweat in. So I injured my knee, I twisted inward, and I heard a click, and I didn't think I had torn my ACL, but I knew something was wrong and went to urgent care to see what had happened, and it ended up being a torn ACL. I was completely devastated. Definitely emotional about it. I knew what it entailed because I had torn my ACL before and I knew how much downtime it entailed and I knew the intense physical therapy and I just knew it was a long road ahead. I think that's why I tried to figure out the best solution right away and I tried to seek medical treatment from various options and various doctors. So Ellen found me through a friend of hers. We did a podcast together talking about ACL repair and how it's a new innovative approach to ACL surgery. Dr. DeFelice said, so I think there's 25% chance I can repair it. I think there's 50% chance I can augment it. And then he said, I think there's a 25% chance that needs to be a full reconstruction. And so as soon as I heard that, we scheduled surgery for the next week. So the goal of modern day ACL reconstruction is to basically replace the ligament. We place a graft in where the ligament used to sit and we place it into little holes in the bone or tunnels. In ACL repair, there are no grafts, there are no tunnels. We're using your native tissue and we're simply reattaching it to the bone. For the ones where the tissue's not quite perfect, we add what's called the internal brace or suture augmentation. It's a stout little stitch that we run along the ACL and anchor down on the bottom. It's almost like having a seatbelt on. She had one of those tears where she was perfect to use the internal brace on. She's a very aggressive athlete, and despite my recommendations, she felt good enough to put it to the test. Today, my knee feels amazing. I'm just impressed every day by how good it feels. And I came back and I really hit the ground running. I was on the elliptical by three weeks. I was back to all my group fitness classes at four weeks. And then I started running again at six weeks. And then I did a half marathon at three months. <laughs> so honestly, just miraculous recovery all around. It was great. We've got quite a number of publications out there that are showing that the patients are doing well, that the complication rates are lower, the recoveries are faster. Everybody's game, no matter what it is, is important to them, and that's kind of what we do, right? We help people get back in the game and enjoy their lives. This recovery for my repair on my ACL was completely different, like worlds different from my ACL reconstruction on my other knee. It was just so mind-blowing. I feel like every new feat I've accomplished, I've been surprised by the results, surprised by the lack of pain, and just surprised by the ability of how quickly I've been able to do it. The fact that I was able to bounce back right away, I think just shocked everyone, including myself. 